I do my under eyes. Nothing is perfect. I know I still have, you know, bags and under eye circles, but I've learned a lot and some few tricks, so I really want to share it with you guys. I'm not that great at doing my makeup, but I do enjoy tips and helps. I used to um, do it the wrong way where I would enhance my bags and under eye circles in not a proper way, and I found some tricks, like I said, so I really want to share them with you guys and how I do my under eyes now, and I hope you guys enjoy this, and it's very informative for you. Love you guys. All right guys, so to start on my under eyes, step one is to apply an eye cream. My favorite eye cream that I've tried so far is the L'Oreal Revitalift. It doesn't really matter what eye cream you use, just something to moisturize your under eyes because if you don't, then they may appear dry. And you do not want that. So if you've had problems with dryness, maybe try an under cream under your makeup and let it sit for a minute before going to apply some primer. My favorite for the under eyes is the Smashbox primer. I use a different primer from under my eyes. I don't know, I just feel like this works perfectly for under my eyes. And this is to prime for the makeup. Next, I am using an orange pigment concealer. And the reason why I'm using this is because this cancels out any bluish or purpley tones. I have a lot of veins or dark eye bags under my eyes, and this will cancel that out. So this one's by NYX. I just recently got this. I'm thinking of going the darker one. I'm just gonna try it out. This one's the light. I do really enjoy it. So the reason why you apply orange under your eyes eyes for any veins is because if you look at your basic color wheel, you see all the bluish purpley tones under your eyes. The way to cancel that out is to look directly across and any yellow, orangey coral, sometimes even red, will cancel out the darkness under your eyes. I just learned this recently and it has helped me so much. So I just take a fluffy brush to apply this and I just dot it only where I have the uh, bluish tints. And if you guys see, as soon as I just put this on, they almost vanish instantly. My bags don't go away. This is not necessarily for my bags, but for the color, it almost disappears immediately. So I just go ahead and blend that in. And I do have some strong veins on my eyelids, so I'm just going to use this to cover that as well. And for the rest of my face, I love my Makeup Forever Primer. I just feel like it really goes well with my foundation. Speaking of, I'm gonna take my damp beauty blender with my Kat Von D Lock It Foundation and apply that just to the one side of my face. I'm just doing one under eye so you guys can see the difference. One of my newest loves is the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. This is amazing and covers like dramatically. I just put like half a pump on my hand and then apply to my under eye in a V formation. Also with my damp beauty blender. I feel like this is just a shade too light for me, but um, I just keep blending it in, working it in. Make sure you're going in patting motions and not swiping motions. I'm pressing this into my skin. Okay, so I cannot stress this enough. A loose translucent powder. This one's by NYC, so it's very, very cheap. I was wondering why I was having creasing under my eyes and why it just looked kind of, you know, not right. And then I researched and found that you need a translucent powder. And I was like packing on like high coverage foundation powder on my under eyes and it just like creased immediately because those are very delicate areas. So you want a delicate powder on there. So I'm just pressing this into my under eyes and it looks amazing. For the rest of my face, I use the Makeup Forever Pro Finish Powder. And here's the before and after of either side. So you guys can see the purpley-ish on one side and not so much on the other. Again, I'm not the best at doing makeup, but I found these tricks really helped for me. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. So I hope that helped you guys in what to do with under eyes and what I do, not what to do, but some tricks. And um, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys all tomorrow. Mwah!